hi guys good morning good afternoon good evening depending where you're watching me from okay you're welcome back to produce blogs uh, how are you guys doing i hope you're doing fine i'm fine too thanks for asking <laughs> so guys it's lunch time so we're gonna make lunch right now and for lunch we're having gnocchis very simple with butter parmesan cheese and then by the side we have some bruschetta so without wasting time let's do this I already have my water boiling there and I have this pan on the fire that I'm, I'm going to add my butter to it right now. So first of all, let me add, put my gnocchis to cook, which is going to take like two or three minutes, right? It's not like it takes time to cook. Once I dump it here, first of all, I'm going to salt the water. Once um, I'll put the gnocchis and once it, um, it floats, it's done. So, the butter is heated and this one is boiling. So I'll cut the heat right now. I'm going to try the heat. So while this one is toasting, we are going to make the bruschetta. And we are having two, three tomatoes. Here is my tomato, chopped up. So I'm gonna look at this cute basil plant that I bought today. I'm gonna take a few here and chop up and add into the tomatoes with some olive oil and salt. That it's turning out golden brown, beautiful color. It's almost done. Let me leave it to brown a bit more, and it's done. I hope you guys can see it clearly. Look at that golden brown color. So, here I'm adding some olive oil, a strategy, and a little bit of salt. Now stir right now and it's ready looking. So I'm gonna toast the bread. The gnocchi is ready. I'll toast the bread. Let's see. Oh, that is so ready. Look at that. So I'm just gonna sprinkle a bit of pennies on top of it. Let it be. Yeah. And then, I'm going to have the heat. Okay. Take a small one. And I'm gonna add some of this mozzarella cheese on it, you know, like a, and then I'll let it. I'm just gonna cover it a bit, like this. Look at that. Lunch is ready. Okay, this is so simple, fast. So I ended up making some of the bruschettas in the, this is like a margarita bruschetta, right? <laughs> it's like a half pizza, half bruschetta thing. So, um, because of the mozzarella in it. So I ended up making some of it in the air fryer. I found that I, it goes faster, right? You could make it in the frying pan, cover it, and the cheese melts. 
but it takes a bit longer because you have to put the heat on low but what did i do i put it in the air fryer and boom two minutes it was already done so let's give it a try i mean every other person in my house had already carried their food they didn't let me finish as it was coming out they were just boom 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 so i managed to grab that for myself <laughs> okay so let's go it looks delicious mm. you know this um this gnocchi like this is like fried dumplings right it has about the same taste it's very delicious so and that one i already tried you guys you have to try this recipe okay make your bruschetta add some fresh mozzarella cheese to it it gives it uh, a a pizza vibe i don't know <laughs> so good and that gnocchi so good so I'm gonna let you guys go try my recipe right now while I go have lunch. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>